everyone welcome back to druid nymph oracle it's me the druid um yeah i actually never even thought of how to film it like this <coughs> um we're gonna roll the dice you guys seven you guys i've been getting sevens literally this whole night um Eight. Wow, seven, eight. Five. And we have a six. Okay, double three. Interesting. So, and very interesting, it's making um, a pyramid right here. With, well, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. So, and that's, wow, that's very interesting, you guys, um, because during my meditation, um, spirit was calling my attention to the certain, uh, symbol, so, so let's see, um, yeah, you guys, the attacks are heavy, and it's because you are in the process of ascending. Here we go. Five of Wands with the Page of Wands. It's like you're in the process of... Well, I'm getting majorly clearing out the gutters, you guys. Clearing out the gutters. I don't know if... Um, I don't know if any of you all have ever cleaned out gutters before. Um, but it's extremely messy. <laughs> And it's pretty gross because, like, well, it's, it, it's just, it's like a certain rotting smell, you know, because water gets in there, the leaves are dying, you know, and they, it, it has this sort of, like, sludge-like, um, yeah, it's like you're clearing out the sludge from your gutters, you guys. Spirit is making it rain, and I have been hearing that, like, spirit... And it's raining outside, you guys. It, it's been raining for days now. Um, yeah, seven of wands. Hanged man. Six of swords. Queen of pentacles. Yeah, no. It's like... Okay. So we're just wanting me to just do this one. Um... You're listening to your guides, and it, it may be a little bit uncomfortable. Yeah, you may be feeling like, God, am I am I like alone? Like, am I alone in this? Um, you know, is this? You may be questioning. Okay, there, there's some, there's a questioning energy. Um, with this seven of wands over here, it's like man, but you, you did it courageously, like, I, I see that you're approaching this uncertainty very courageously, you are, um, you are allowing yourself to be a medium to the divine, okay, three of swords, yeah, it, it's like, you are approaching this very uncomfortable situation with a sort of vigor, yeah, that the king of pentacles brings, the, the king of pentacles is bringing vigor it, it's bringing labor you know it's blood sweat and tears in a way um you know and, and this figure is very muscular on the other hand you have this guy and it's like i feel like you guys don't let these cheap ass this is this is cheap energy you guys this energy coming to a king of pentacles, it's like, oh, buy my, buy my, like, freaking, you guys, I can't even, it's just tacky, okay? It's like literally opening a trench coat, getting some, like, second hand-me-down, I don't even freaking know, like, off-brand, off like, whatever, and, tr and trying to sell it to somebody with taste, with class, okay? His work, see how his face is a pinnacle? It's like, 
his work is his mind. His mind has achieved him this sort of abundance the king of, that the, only the King of Pentacles can achieve, right? And it was interesting because we saw the counterpart, the Queen of Pentacles, earlier. And this freaking loser right here, yeah, with the magician coming out, no. I'm, no. No. No, you guys. Ten of Wands with the magician, with, so nine going back to ten. It's like, this freak over here was trying to sell you something that it was never going to be, okay? It just never was going to be. It was never going to be authentic. It's like, it's never going to get verified. You know, um, like those antique shows where <clears throat> certain people come in and it's like, they're like thinking that they have this like mega heirloom and it, it you know, and it turns out it's like five dollars or something, you know, they thought they had this like priceless freaking jewel of the, you know, like jewel of Africa, like. Because what I'm getting is, like, they slept on their abundance, okay? They literally slept on it, you guys. They found it to be burdensome with the Ten of Wands. And then they're trying to come back into the situation and sell you this bullshit. I'm sorry. It's bullshit. And, and I see you seeing so clearly through this, you guys, back to the Page of Wands. It's like, this is, this is what you're getting back to. <clears throat> the beginning, this is like a little grassy knoll, you guys. This is like your own little small patch of heaven that I'm getting, that's, you know, again, with, with the three, very interesting because, again, back to our dice, like there's this you're reaching this apex, okay, and at the top of that apex is three. No coincidence, the, uh, the greatest mystery of all, the Trinity, right? Like, in a way, the Trinity is, is, is all of the mysteries embodied into one, right? You know, the world is full of mysteries. Ten of Wands to the Page of Wands. It's like, that's exactly what you're doing. You're going right back to, to the beginning. You're going to the source of, of, of the damage, right? Because, wow, what I'm getting is that... You have to have fire to forge steel, right? It's no coincidence. The Page of Wands is a burning... It's a... It's a... It's a... It's a novice... Yes, Page. But... Isn't that what a fool is? A novice? To the world? To his world? Spirit's wanting me to show you this little, it's just a dried flower. That may mean, that color may mean something to you. Um, anyways, so like wand energy with, with the um, swords, right? And swords represent thoughts, right? And so your actions are now defining your thoughts. No longer are your thoughts defining your actions. You are embodying true grace. Because you don't have to, 
you yourself don't have to think you are flowing this is flow state okay there's a reason why there's a paddle okay this is pure flow hangs man you guys you're flowing hanged man is a severely underrated card you guys hanged man is i feel like hanged man is up there with high priestess and hermit you know it's, it's that same i'm seeing a higher font the king of cups very interesting okay guys some very exciting things are happening though like in this this flow state in this yeah all right let's clear this because there's a new um, yeah sorry if it's been kind of loud i just it's it's pretty cool you guys this guy will not you you need to clear this energy you guys like this Whatever you have to do, you guys, you may be in the middle of it. I, I don't, I truly do not know. But by, by all means, you guys, this is a matter of your legacy. Okay. And you have to take it extremely seriously. You have to wake up, take it very seriously. And yeah, Empress, you, and you are, I, I see that you're doing that because, you know, as above, so below you guys. all about redefining like I was talking earlier the page and that that sword energy that wand and sword energy you guys because wands are all about action swords are all about thought ace of pentacles strength three of pentacles mm -hmm. This king of wands. Okay, hold on. Yep, five of pentacles, justice. Let's get more on this justice. Before I get into this, you guys. Queen of cups. Yes. This situation has brought you... It may have felt like very so uncomfortable, is what I'm hearing, so uncomfortable. Um, chariot, Nine of Pentacles. Okay, what is this? Tempest, interesting. Okay. This situation, King of Pentacles to the Five of Pentacles. Where this person has put you in a position that felt very burdensome. Lovers are going to pop out. Two of swords. Yeah. It, it, it made you run up this tree with spirit. Because you were like, I gotta freaking get out of here. Lovers to the seven of swords. You know, seven is a number of completion. You were like, I gotta get up out of here. And that's exactly what you did. See, with the Ace of Pentacles strength to the um, Three of Pentacles. You were like, I'm gonna get up out of here and um, I'm gonna plant. Like, it was like you uprooted. You were grasping that pinnacle you had to you had to be strong in this and it only brought you more abundance with one came came three and again with that this divine three you guys lest we forget and this this brought you into this justice with the queen of cups it brought you full mastery of the emotions how fitting it's like your actions Remember how we were talking about the forging? You forged, you forged through this. 
and it gave you mastery into the emotional realm because the queen of cups is one of the most abundant of the deck in my opinion queen of cups is very attractive here we go and the spirit's like no no the most abundant could possibly be high priestess because She's, you know, directly connected to the divine. There is no separation. Okay, Spirit's wanting me to highlight this again. It's like this virginal, you know, state of being. Medusa energy. Medusa was, was going to be... Um, A high priestess, right? And she was getting more attention. And Zeus raped her, right? I'm pretty sure that's how that parable goes. Yeah, three of cups to the chariot. Well, telling you, you were like, I'm getting up out of here. Okay. Um, cutting my losses. See, three of cups. Cutting my losses. Like, you had an outpour. Yeah. You were like, there is something beyond all of this after this. You were like, you were okay to put down your swords because you didn't want to fight this person to begin with. You didn't. I feel like this is what you were bringing to the table always. And that's why you were, in, you were able to embody this strength, queen of cups... Mm -hmm. You guys, they want to record me so bad. <sighs> Anyways. You may have like a stalker on you, you guys. You may have something. It's just like very burdensome energy. Yeah. Getting like pain in the back. It's like, yes. No, this person was going to backstab you always. Lovers to the magician in reverse. Fool. You're, I'm telling you, you were like, I'm getting out of here. I have to. This was, this was self-preservation. This was an act of God. I'm hearing, yes, it was nothing. It was, you were suspended and... You're suspended in the air before you made this decision. And I feel like you're fully committing to your role. Yeah, Inferno. It's like you are mowing it down. Like you were you were you were cutting it down. And all the snakes are getting chopped up. Empress, you guys. Like <laughs> Like, they would have to be a tiny little... And even then, the little snakes, like, they're getting their tails chopped off. Like, something's going down, you guys. Inferno to the... Yes. No, this is elemental. This goes back... Like, you were invoking... It's because, you guys, you always had this cosmic power, Okay. We all have cosmic power because of our creator, the sun. Come on. <laughs> well, I mean, you guys, sometimes spirit leaves me speechless, y'all. I'm like, wow, ten of cups, wow. Ten of cups, high priestess to the temperance. I'm just, I'm flabbergasted right now. Hold on. Let me clear this out. Oh gosh, you guys. This freaking loser back here. Don't ever talk to this person again. Please. Like, when, when you're fully saying goodbye to this person, like, let it be final, you guys. You are moving into such, you are moving into such justice, okay? No one's gonna run you up a tree anymore. You know... I'm getting somebody really, like, they just took you for granted, y'all, world. They took, you know, it was, they just pop, 
justice at the bottom. It's like... You guys... This person may have really wanted to block you and, you know, things that you had to say, you may... They may have wanted you to think, you know, that... You know, possibly you were crazy. Again, with the Medusa thing. With the High Priestess thing. It's like... No. Everybody wants to be in touch... Everybody wants to have a relationship with their creator. I'm, I've been getting this, this message of Frankenstein. But it's like... They crave a relationship with the creator. And so whenever they see you embodying this relation... This is one of the most... Um, like, devout relationships. And I'm getting that. Wow, and then with the temperance, y'all. It's like, no, you guys. This is, this is so big. And I feel like maybe it's, you gotta take a step back and really look at what you're working with here. And realize how in tune you are. Okay. See this high priestess with her antennas? Well, I mean, they're antlers, but I'm seeing them as antennas right now. And it's like, like that is fine tuned. See how many prongs there are? That is fine tuned. And that's why the temperance is coming out right immediately after. It's like, of course they'd be jealous of you, love. Of course it is it is of course they're going to try and stop you. And you're doing perfectly gr great. You're doing amazing right now. Okay? You're doing everything in your power and don't worry. You don't ha you don't have to have the burden of weighing these hearts, okay? God is going to do that for for everyone. Tower. The only thing you have to worry about is being precious, keeping your preciousness sacred. And that's what I'm getting with this Ten of Cups. It's like, these are the cups that you are giving yourself. And it may sound cliche, but it's not. That's what they want you to think, okay? They want you to think that loving yourself truly, truly listening to your intuition. This is what it's all about, guys. You are an ancient sovereign being. This is who I'm talking to. Because you are source, okay? Your light codes, they come from something, okay? These codes you have that, you know, maybe not everyone's... Wow. Hierophant with the justice. Not ever, yeah. So we're saying not everyone's heart is measured equally because not everyone's heart is equal. Yeah. Page of Wands again, you guys. It's like you're blazing true. I'm blazing true. Wow. It's like the blazing truth, you guys. It's a burning truth that you hold in your heart, okay? And that's, you know, that's why I picked my picture um, as, um, you know, it's a sacred heart. It is a heart in search of divine truths. The created needs to know the creator, okay? Needs to hear the creator. I'm getting five, the six senses. Yeah. Blazing true. <laughs> You guys, it's like you're blazing truth and blazing true all of this.
taking no prisoners. You let them, you let them do all that, okay? What a job, you guys. What a job to have to do that. Like, <laughs> these, like, petty little, yeah, I'm just getting bitches. Like, really? Yeah. It's just greedy, you guys. These, like, greedy energies, petty energies. They're just so greedy for attention. Like, they're so greedy for glorification. Wow. I'm telling you. It's like, it's no coincidence this is coming out on the table. Is that the Ten of Pentacles? And what's at the bottom, though? This sucker. <laughs> you guys. Y'all stay up on the apex, okay? Y'all are apex predator, alright? You're killing it out there, is what I'm hearing. Bye, you guys.